What's going on today, people? You already know what it is. It's your boy Tunchi, and this is YBE TV. Uh, today, I want to holler at you guys uh, about a question that came from Saleh Williams, and it's titled Freightliner versus Peterbilt. And before we do that, I got to pay some bills. Hit me up at www.ybetv.org, and I will definitely hit you back with a response to your question. This one says, Hi, Toon. Says, Hi, YBE. My name is not YBE, Saleh. Saleh Williams, Ms. Williams, or Mr. Williams. It says, I found your channel. I've been researching this owner-operator venture for my husband, and I, I knew it was a woman. It is a woman. Ty runs for a company. I'm in the military, about to retire in four years, so we need to get this going. Working on the LLC, EIN, bank account, and credit cards for the business. Credit scores, his is high sevens, mine me at eight. Kicking some tail. Issue, husband and I can't agree on going going the Freightliner versus Pete. I say Freightliner, buy it outright. If we do Pete, we'll be financed. Looking into the troops into transportation mentioned in one of your videos. Help, I'm trying to convince him Freightliner is the way to go. Oh, I like you, Miss Williams. Okay. This is for the husband. Uh, pass him the phone right now so he can see this. All right. Um, husband, uh, what, what? I think Ty. I think his name is Ty, right? Let me see. Name is Ty. First thing, Ty, I am going to tell you go Freightliner. Freightliner is a lot cheaper to deal with. And Peterbilt, you, you don't need that. It's all types of muscle and power, but it does last longer. So, you know, like Freightliners break a little bit more than Peterbilt's, but sometimes, you know, depending on the Pete, you might get a few issues with it too. So, you know, that could that could always end up <laughs> balancing itself out. But the Peter, the Freightliners has been built a lot better. Uh, you know, recently the Freightliners has been built a lot better. So, me, personal preference, I always say Freightliner. Because Freightliners is a lot cheaper to fix. A lot cheaper to fix. Like, for example, my man got a Freightliner. His turbo went out. My turbo went out on my uh, on my Freightliner. Went out. And my man had a Peterbilt. I'm sorry. My man had a Peterbilt. His Peterbilt, the turbo went out. He paid close to $5,000 to fix it. My freight line, I barely touched 2200 You know, but, like, that's how it is. Like, with the Peets, they built to last, though. They are definitely built to last. And the freight liners are getting, they got a lot better with the bills. So, you you know, like, I, I just got definitely say that now, as far as working on the EIN, LLC, bank account, and credit cards, I'm going to tell you like this. Everything that you said sounded great, but. Getting those business credit cards, you sound like you ready to use your social security number. No, no. Sign up for my course, www.ybetv.org slash course, and it's going to teach you the router to the tutor to establishing your business, and it, you'll be able to do it at the right time before you start this business. You definitely need to sign up for that class because the one thing is, your credit score, your personal credit score, is for personal things. That's for your car at home. That's for your house at home. You use that for your personal belongings. You use that for the things that's personal. You don't need to use your personal credit score to finance your business. And getting business credit cards, you do not need to use your personal credit score to get business credit cards. I hope that's helpful because you're going to need to sign up for my class. It's $50. Sign up for it now because it will not stay $50 forever. I'm telling you now, as it begins to get more and more popular and people understand more and more the value of it, it's going to go up in price. So if I was you, I would sign up for it now and you will be able to set your business up correctly and keep your credit score to yourself and be able to work on that Paydex score, which is for your business. I hope that's helpful, and I hope you sign up for the class at www.ybetv.org/slash course. C O U R S E.
Hope that's helpful. You already know what it is. It's your boy, Tunchi. Thank you for reaching out. And I say my vote is that Freightliner. If you don't want to end up in the box, think outside of it. YBE. Drug dealing and killing is going on in my town. Yeah, don't take a killer to kill or a driller to drill. See, just being yourself is the definition of real.